Hello, students. Logan Phillips here. In this video, we're going to talk about your LMS, or Learning Management System. Now, at TCC, our LMS is our Blackboard system. And if you've taken college courses here at TCC, or if you've taken college courses at other universities, you may have experienced different types of LMSs. Now, for TCC students, you may have been introduced to Blackboard Classic. And for other universities, you might have seen things like Brightspace, or D2L, or Chalkboard, or any of those types of other big LMSs. Now, an LMS is just a way to manage the data and content inside the class. It's basically our web page for our classroom. So, in this video, we're going to break down the pieces of our LMS, where to find things, how to access different information, and just a basic overview. Shouldn't take very long, it's not going to be very in-depth, but it will help you in this class for navigation and everything else. Now, if you're new to TCC, or if this is your first semester, uh, you might be becoming introduced to something called Blackboard Ultra. Now, this is the newest style of Blackboard courses that we have, and uh, this is what all of our courses are going to be organized in. So, it might be very new, even if you are a previous existing student. So, I want to start off by just opening us up into our course. Now, when you come into our class, you're going to see a few different key pieces of information. If you scroll all the way to the top, you're going to see the full name of your class. It will say it's 16, and 8A, and 8B, whatever it is. So, if 16, if it says here at the end, 16, that means you're a 16-week course. If it means says 8A, that means you're an eight-week first eight-week. If it says 8B, eight-week second eight-week. You're also going to find here the full name of your class. This is Business, Data, Science, Technologies. Your section number, and it's going to tell you if it's online, blended, or face-to-face. -face. Now, for this particular class, we can see that it is blended. On the left-hand side, we're going to see some key, key pieces of information. <clears throat> first is your beautiful, smiling instructor, me, Logan Phillips. How do you email me? Below that, you can see a roster of everyone in our class, and you can see a little bit of class participation and things of that nature. Now, on the top is where we're going to be our navigation ribbon. Now, on our navigation ribbon, you're always going to open up first into our content. This is where you're going to find all the basic stuff about the course. Your assignments, your courseware, this instructional video. Next to it, you're going to find your calendar. Any assignments or modules that are set to a schedule will be here inside your calendar. Next, after that, we're going to have announcements. Every single announcement that comes into the class will be here. You need to check your announcement page very, very often. If you see an announcement and you haven't read it before, just click on it, open it up, and it's going to give you a bunch of information uh, that you may need from course updates, homework updates, due date updates, uh, clarification on the assignments, that kind of things. Your discussion boards are assignments in this class. You can directly link them here underneath discussions or underneath the learning modules. And of course, for you students, one of the most important things is your grade book. Here you're going to find all your assignments inside the class, the assigned grade that you've earned inside of it, and that kind of information. So as you go through the course, feedback will be listed, your grade you reserved, or you received, and what's coming up due. Any messages that I send out to the class in an email will be here. And if we decide to work inside groups, not really likely for my classes, I don't particularly like them, uh, they'll be located here. But for the most part, in our class, you're going to be underneath two sections, content and announcements. Content being where all of our instructional material is, and announcements, any updates. So underneath content, we're going to first look at the very top most important piece, and that's our course information stickied post. Now, if you notice this course information stickied post, it says at the very top, important notice. This is going to give you your start date, end date, section date, final due date, your WN date, the modules of the assignments, the orders you're going to do things in, our late work policy, our pacing schedule, due date times, our plagiarism policy, and any AWWN incompletes. This is all the basic information about your course that you will need to put into your course calendar. Below that, you're going to start with your assignments over, or your start here. Inside start here, this is a learning module, you're going to be introduced to a variety of pieces. Who I am, what is data analytics, how Blackboard layout, which is what you're watching right now, and so forth and so forth. Now, after that, you're going to come into our assignments overview. These videos are going to break down each of the types of assignments and how to complete them. If you have any questions on a type of assignment, the point values, uh, snag points, things that can go wrong, pretty much is going to be covered here in your assignment overview. After you're done with your begin here and your assignment overviews, you're going to start before the WN date of the class on your first assignment learning modules. Here you're going to be introduced to a few things. First, 
What are the introductory assignments? You're going to complete your introductory syllabus assignment where you're going to use that information from that course information sticky post. You're going to be introduced to your uh, pacing schedule assignment where you're going to use the course information sticky post. Then you're going to go into um, overview of cheating and plagiarism. You're going to take a cheating and plagiarism pledge that you will not accomplish it. Acknowledge that you understand that a plagiarism or cheating in this class results in a zero that were zero tolerance. You're going to do your student introductions, which can be linked here. And then at the very end, you're going to take your syllabus quiz. Now, once you've done that, you're allowed to stay in the class. If you fail to do these assignments before the WN day of the class, you will be dropped for non-attendance. Now, after you've done this introductory assignments, your first assignments, you're going to have modules through the class. Now, we have eight modules plus a capstone module. For this first week, for the first three days to five days, you're art, you are going to only see the first module, module one, driving business success. Once you open it up, you're going to find a exact same layout for every single module. You're going to start off with an introduction of what the module is about. That's going to include lecture videos, supplemental videos, any of that kind of stuff. You're going to take a pre-quiz for the module. Now this pre-quiz is pass-fail. If you take it, you will pass it, you will get the full points. Now it will grade you based on how many point things you got correct or incorrect. But once I see that, I convert it over to full points. After the pretest, you will take your instructional videos, you'll read your textbook, you'll do a case study, you'll do a discussion board, and take your project for the module, you'll do an exam, and then you will do a journal at the very end of it that is a reflection. This is the layout for every single course module inside of our class. So guys, this is the Blackboard course. It's extremely easy to navigate. If you have any questions, comments, concerns, please ask. You can always email me directly from the Blackboard Ultra course. Or if you have questions that might be answered inside the syllabus, inside those pieces, you will find all that here. Your syllabus and pacing schedule will be underneath your um, Begin Here New Learning Module, uh, First Assignment Module. I guess I'm Logan Phillips. If you have any questions, comments, concerns, let me know. Otherwise, enjoy the class.